Hello everybody, this is Clay Jones with Fox Hills Disc Golf Productions. We're here today to bring you some excellent coverage of the Gator Basket Bash brought to you by Dynamic Discs and Latitude 64. We got Evan Gerthy after one round at 10 down, Nicholas following up at 8 down, Charlie 7, Adam right behind him at 6, Ron bringing it up behind at 4 down. I always want to thank the Gainesville Parks and Recreation Department. They really help the Chainhawks out here. We're at Northside Park, Gainesville, Florida. Oldest disc golf course in Florida. Established in 1982. We got Evan leading off right now. Hole one. Oh, a beautiful skip shot. Park job. Very nice. Nicholas is lining up a forehand. Going to flirt with that bathroom wall just a little bit. But after that, it's a wide open shot. Nicholas comes around, skips in. Looking good. Little roll. Very nice. Looking good. Next up, we got Charlie Goodpasture. Charlie's lining up a backhand. He's going to throw some type of flippy putter. And that's looking good. Oh, yeah. Oh, a little slow down. Nice. Man, that was close. Next up we got Adam Rogers, local guy. Adam gives it a good sturdy run down the center. Needs to hook up. Mmm, stayed straight. It's gonna leave him a long look at Birdie. Adam's a great putter, he'll give it a good run. Next up we got Ron Howell. Ron's out of the Clearwater area. He's been playing for a pretty good while. Ron gives it a good run around, looking for a big skip, oh, came up a little short, caught some tree, he's going to have a, have a circle's edge putt for the birdie, see if Ron can get this to go, oh, sawed it off just a little bit, Adam's got a 35 footer, something like that, a little high, a little high. Charlie lining up. Charlie's got about a, I'd say 28, 27 footer, something like that. Ooh, Charlie cashes in the bird. Having to clean up first par. Good job. Evan for the birdie. Very nicely done. Nicholas to tap in for his birdie. Great putt. Oh, and dog the like dog it. likes it. We've got this chihuahua on hole two that uh, makes some pretty impressive noises. I'll probably edit that out for you guys. All right, we got some twos and a couple of pars there. Stays the same at the top. And Evan on hole two. Evan and Garrett were basically raised on this hole. They grew up in the apartment complexes right next door. I promise the dog is not being tortured. He just doesn't like being tied up on the back of his house. Oh, Evan pulls it a little long. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a doozy for a bird there. Nicholas pulls it out wide. He's flirting with the OB. Comes back, stabled up a little better, and he's going to have, oof, I'd say a 55 footer for Birdie. It's 3.43 to the basket in this location.
Charlie pulls one, looks a little high, he doesn't look happy with it. Dog is definitely not happy with it. Oh, he catches a tree, he's going to have a 45-footer. Yeah. Adam's going to come up and give it a run. Oh, Adam grabs a hold of it. Low laser beam out of bounds. That's too bad. All right, let's see what Ron can do with this hole two here at Northside. Oh, that's looking good. Oh, little picture and picture action. Oh, yeah, Ron with a very nice run. Everybody likes that one. Alright, here's Adam with his up shot. He's still got a, a couple hundred feet at least there away. He throws a hyzer up. Oh, a little short. Coming down. A little bit of a roll. He's got a solid 35, 40 footer there, it looks like. Save par. Evan for a very long look at birdie here. He gives it a little bit of a run, but I think that was mainly a up shot. Let's see if Nicholas can cash in here. He's got a solid 50, 55 foot putt here, I would say. Oh, very nice nicely of... done. Oh, get a little slow mo on this one. Oh, yeah. That's nice, man. Let's double it up. That looks like a circle two putt right there. Look at that. Very nice. Bam. Right in the sweet spot. All right. Charlie's going to give it a little run here. Oh, it comes up a little short. Adam to save par. Sorry, that was a save. That was a safe bogey. Very nicely done. Nice bird by Mr. Howell. Good job, Ron. Evan to tap in his par. All right, Charlie will tap in and we'll move on to hole three. Nicholas and Ron with the birdie there. Nicholas will lead us off on hole three. It's a 282. Par three, tight gap in the middle basically, and then it's pretty open. Just got to get down there. Nicholas gives it a good run coming in, and he's got a little tester. Oh, nice leapfrog over the planter. I'd like to give a shout out to Gene Stuckey for those planters. He did a great job with that and does a great job with everything around this course. And just like all the volunteers, the chain hawks are awesome. Oh, Ron, looking good. Right down the middle. That's where you want to be. Heiser's out a little bit early. He's going to give himself about 25 footer. Alright, Evan. Going with a little flick action. Oh, gets a little palmetto love there. Comes around. He may have to contend with that little guy, that little tree a little bit, but he's in great shape. Charlie stepping up. Doing his routine. It's pretty gusty out there today. The wind was even blowing the camera around. I think right when Charlie started here, uh, started getting a little gusty. You can see some of the trees back there moving around. So He took a second to... Uh, just wait and check it out and then just laces one right down the center I mean you just don't play that hole much better than that we're gonna get a little another look at that with a little dial in shot here some sweet graphic action here it comes I mean he just bounced down about circles edge and then just scoots right up there man 
I mean, that's just what you want. No stress. You're making that putt every single time. Just relaxed. It's beautiful. Adam, little early release. Finds a little early gap there. He's getting through. I'm going to leave himself 45 foot or something like that. <clears throat> Gives a little bit of a run. Came up a little short. Here's Evan for the 50 footer, I want to say. Oh, all day, man. Beautiful putt. Beautiful putt. Ron to cash in on his nice drive. See if he can get this one to go. Oh, I think the wind knocked that one down a little bit. Nicholas with a solid putt, nose down, that thing's fighting the wind, very nice looking putt. Nice low putt with Adam, good job, good clean up. Alright, that does it for hole three. Charlie taps in his beautiful birdie. And two, 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 and a couple of threes. We'll move on to hole four. Guys, we're back. We're at hole four. 296, A position, low ceiling, got a little bit of stuff to get by. It's a fair fairway. Got to get down there and avoid a root skip and some palmettos. Let's see what Nicholas does. He's throwing a PA1. And he's not too good into the trees. Not happy with that one. See what Evan's got going on here. Evan's got it up, flirting with the ceilings, looking good. Heiser's out a little early. He's gonna have a tester there. That's gonna be a that's gonna be a good one. Charlie lining up his backhand. Takes a stop for a second, regroups. Good looking shot. Oh, Charlie skips by. He's got a 25 footer, 30 footer comeback for the birdie. Oh, Ron with a really nice looking throw. Very nice. Oh, that one looked nice. Got some palmettos in the back. He'll have a nice looking birdie putt there. A little obstructed, but I think he can handle it. Adam with a good looking throw. A little stable. Not happy. Alright, here we go. Let's see who can cash in on some birds. Nicholas with an upshot. Flicks one up there, nice skip up to the basket, looking good, very nicely done. And I'm going to give her a run, oh man, that was a nice effort, nice effort. Here's Evan, solid, I don't know, 40 foot, 38 footer, cashing the bird, keep this thing going. I was doing a bit of a modified straggle putt, I guess you would call it. 
Oh, nice yeah, skip baby. shot. Sweet slow-mo action here. Oh yeah, looking great. Nice shot. Gets a little love from fellow chain hawk Adam Rogers. Alright, here's Charlie to see if he can uh, come out from behind the palmettos and cash in his birdie. Oh, very nice little hyzer putt right into the sweet spot. Nicholas, similar putt, a little less obstructed, maybe a couple feet closer. Puts it in strong left low. Right, let's see if we can get three in a row here. Boom, there we go. Nice job, guys. Adam tap out his par, and we will move on to hole five. Evan with a still with a two-stroke lead. Charlie right behind Nicholas. One stroke behind. Hole 5, 340. You got to go over the Out of Bounds Creek. And Evan has thrown a beautiful looking turnover. Here it comes. I mean, that's money right there. Beautiful. Yeah, Evan. All right, Charlie coming up, clearing a couple of wood chips off, checking it out. Then they throw a backhand as well. So I just line up a little bit of an angle here. And Charlie tries to get more of a straight route and... Oh, catches that tree and hits the creek out of bounds. Tough break. See how Ron does here. He's also lining up a backhand. A oh, good looking shot. Easy to turn over a little bit more. Stables up a little bit early. He's going to have a... 70, 75 footer for Bird. Alright, let's we'll see what Nicholas is going to throw a forehand down there. And he's done a great shot. It's going to skip right in there, just short of the creek for a good look at Birdie. Adam's throwing backhand. And Adam's disc is stabled up just a little bit early for him there. He's just clear of the ditch. Oh, we missed uh, Charlie's upshot. was pretty quick there. Uh, we'll catch up here with Adam on his upshot. Oh, he gets a good run. Good run. Oh, tough break. Uh, that's what we call the tournament roll. Not happy with that. He didn't go out of bounds, so it could have been worse. Ron, with his attempt, I'd say that one's about a 65-footer. He's going to straddle this guy, give it a good run, catches a little bit of basket early, and just not quite enough. And Adam's got a siren to contend with there, and um, gives her a run. Oh, good run, catches some basket, no go. Nicholas is on the edge of OB there. He's going to take his meter. And I think he's decided he's already there. And he's going to mark his disc. And putt from there after he checks the wind for a little. Looks like a little headwind. He's going to have to keep that nose down. And he does so nicely, very nicely done. Evan about six inches away from CTP there. And Evan cashes in off that beautiful drive, very nicely done. And Ron's going to clean up there.
Charlie's going to tap out for his bogey and Adam for his par. And we'll move on to hole six. This will be the last hole in this part of the video. There will be three parts of this video. So you guys please stay tuned and um, subscribe and everything. That helps us out, keeps us going, and uh, helps us keep putting out these videos. I was going to try to launch one down the middle here. Let's it go. Stables up a little. Oh, catches a little hanger yeah, there. The same exact line. Nah, it's going to be a rough up shot there. It's 320 to the basket. Straight down there, but man, it's guarded. Nicholas, let's go. And he's going to catch some early guardian trees there on to the right. He's going to have a long look at birdie. Let's see if Ron can get something down there a little closer. Ron lets a nice looking shot go. Tries to sneak through but catches some late trees. He's going to also have a pretty long look at birdie. Charlie lets a good looking shot go. Fading out a little early there. Mm. We'll have to see once we get up there. Adam shot. He's got a little, maybe a little bit of the laser beam action on that one, and it bottoms out a little early there. Everybody's got long looks. Team up shot here. Let's thank uh, William Tribble for uh, his support and the whole disc golf scene and really helping Evan out and just in general being a great guy. And that's a great up shot. There was a lot going on there Evan had to deal with. You can see the line he had to deal with right through there. Nicholas gets to go around a little bit. He's going to hyzer give it a little bit of a run, but pretty much another up shot. I think at this point Adams decided he's going to give it a run. He doesn't really uh, worry about that kind of stuff too much. Oh, gives it a good run. Goes long. He's going to have a little funky little putt back there. That's going to be a little low ceiling he's going to have to deal with. Ron's going to have to straddle out pretty good to get around these two trees. He's got a solid 50-footer here. Gives it a good run. Oh, just comes up a little short. All right, Adam Rogers here, Olympic hurdler. Uh, he made the Olympic team. Let's see what he can do with this guy. Look at that form there, guys. Oh, that's yeah, a nice putt, guys. I got to tell you, nobody practices that. That's just good stuff. Nicholas taps out for his par. Charlie. Nice job. Again, we'd like to thank that Parks and Rec Department in Gainesville, Florida. These guys are out here all the time helping us out, man. They just really, really help us out. We appreciate it a lot. All right, there you go. Charlie with the lone birdie on that one. So Evan will take a two-stroke lead into hole seven. Really appreciate Dynamic Disc for coming out and putting this thing on. Thanks again for watching, you guys. Um, really appreciate it. If you guys would subscribe, once again, it just really helps us uh, keep this whole deal going and put out more videos. Really want to thank Jim Lupino. He's been a big help to us for a long time. And Alan Shorter just did a super great job on the camera in Tallahassee the, a couple weeks ago and, and on this one, so I just want to thank him a lot. And last but not least, my incredible wife, Michelle Jones, uh, without whom none of this would be possible. Thank you so much for all your help. You're the best.